stood up in the houses of Parliament to tell them that my shows should be cancelled in London and in Manchester. What? Thank you. I tell you what, I feel better already because I've been to Glasgow before. Oh, fucking last night. <laughs> So I know that I'm friends. Yeah. Free children of God. Don't be surprised if I get emotional tonight because I'm I'm, I'm teaching on the edge. You know, I really am. But I feel good here. I love it. Right, we're going to do a new song, new uh, It's something I wrote during COVID. It's called The Bar. Uh, when we were all sitting at home, you know, wondering whether to be a vaxxer or an anti-vaxxer, um, that my brain went, um, do you remember when you could go to a bar or a pub or somewhere and you could meet your friends and have a drink or not have a drink? But you could also meet strangers and you could sit around and talk about things. And that, it was good. That was the good thing about the pub. I don't know if you've still got many here. I bloody well hope so. It's a great institution. Anyway. Uh, so, we've got a bar here this evening. It's this baby grand piano. Some of you down here can see that it's covered in shot glasses and bottles of colourless liquid that might or might not be water. Some of it is. <laughs> Okay, um, so this is the bar, okay, but for the purposes of this evening, the whole of the hydro and everybody in it is in the bar, so we can all talk to one another without fear or favour, without worrying that we're going to be cancelled by some motherfucker somewhere, okay, so it's all good in here. Say what you like. Um, what else? Oh yeah, the bar is a very long song. We're only going to do one little verse of it at the moment. Um, when we were designing this show, Sean Evans and I, we thought, let's do a big screen. Yeah, good idea. And we did, as you can see. Um, but then we thought, what about if we do a show where half of it is cinema and half of it is a rock and roll? Good idea. Let's do a bit of cinema, and then a song, and then a bit more cinema and blah. So I wrote a narrative. We gave up the idea after a bit, realising it was beyond us. It was too complicated, and you had to film it all and stuff. Anyway, but I did write the screenplay, and, and uh, some of the characters who are in the screenplay are in this first verse. There are two of them. They're both women. One is an old black woman who lives... She's homeless. She lives on the streets of New York City in the rain, in the wind, and the cold, in a pile of cardboard with a, her pet dog, who is a chihuahua dog called Lady. And she's not in good shape, so she's there lonely. The other is a younger woman, a Native American woman. She's a Lakota Sioux from Standing Rock in North Dakota. She comes across the old lady, talks to her, bubbles her up and persuades her to go with her. God, I'm glad I got the rest of it. I was in the middle of the verse. Anyway, um, yeah, she brambles her up and she brings her here to the bar so that all of us here can help look after her. So this is the bar.